Hello everybody, this is Andrew Roboto 2021 here, and welcome back to Finance Warriors Below the Depths. We will be taking on Knights 3 and 4 in this video. So without further ado, we'll take on Knights 3 and 4, and let's see what there's to offer for us. And I wonder who we're dealing with that's going to be new this night. Oh, we got Mario and Luigi. Okay. Mario and Luigi, or as they are known as in this game, the Plumber Brothers, are now active. Are now active. One will be approaching you when you use your cameras. The moment when you don't hear its music box, which I assume it's Mario because because Mario has the music box mechanic and Final Fantasy Warriors won a couple other games. And then for. And it will be in your office. Open the monitor. Get rid of it before it attacks. The other one will move toward your office via getting in the crossroad. Which I had no idea there was a crossroad in this game. <laughs> Turn the lights on and off to scare it before it scares you. Okay. Okay, so we're dealing with Mario and Luigi for night three. Here we go. And do we get a phone call? All right, should do. Ah, Rosalina. Hey, welcome back. Okay, so apparently Rosalina is a Golden Friday in this game. Rosalina, I think, is just an Easter egg. It didn't tell me how to deal with Rosalina. Oh, but I see Luigi, he has his neck tied to a rope, apparently. That's disturbing. Okay, so I wonder how we're going to deal with Mario and Luigi. There's Luigi and Waluigi. Up Toad here. Up Waluigi, gotta deal with him. Just had to deal with Toad. Up Luigi's here. Okay, so when Luigi come... So for Luigi, same mechanic as Waluigi. When he comes to the door, you have to flash the light at him. But difference is, though, for Waluigi, you only have to flash the light at him once. Luigi, you have to flash it repeatedly to get rid of him. Again, Wario's about to come soon. Oh, here he is. I see his head poking out of the hallway. Oh, I hear a music box. That's definitely Mario, so... Mario, I'm guessing, is going to be the one where when the music box stops, we have to put up a camera. Just 
Okay, so when Mario's music box stops, we have to put the camera up. That's... Oh, here's Waluigi and Luigi, just double toad. Good. Oh, Waluigi's here. Fuss the light of him. Luigi's about to come now. Oh, Mario! Okay, so I was correct. Mario, you have to put the music, put the camera up when he comes in the office after the music box stops. Okay. Mario, same mechanic as Rosalina. Up here's Luigi. Okay, just double with Luigi. Perfect. Now, Mario's mechanics are also the same for Find Up in Nintendo Land. We gotta like hide in the shack when the music box stops. And plus, Mario has like the music box mechanic and and the original Final Fantasy Warrior game. Okay, I see Wario and Waluigi. They're coming. Toads here. Get rid of him. Waluigi. Then Wario's gonna be up next because he also left the camera. Alright, so he's up next. And then we got Luigi. Warriors here. Now I gotta go check out Toad and then Luigi's up next. There you go. Got rid of him. Perfect. Let's see, Toad's not there, so that's good. Toad's here. Luigi's here. And I hear Mario's music box, so he'll be coming any minute. Oh, Luigi's on the camera, so that means he's going to be coming soon. Oh, Mario's here. And then Wario and Luigi are going to be coming next. Checking for Toad, not in the camera, so that's good. Up, oh, Luigi. There you go, got rid of him. Good, good. Toad, got to deal with him. Are you serious, Toad? I just, I was clicking on the camera repeatedly, and yet you had to bang the, the you had to bang the circuit breakers? And thankfully we beat night three because Toad just had to had to drain the power at the worst possible moment. Oh, we got a cutscene. Okay, so apparently we're in the original Final to Wario's office from the first game. Interesting. Why do we have this cutscene? Apparently the power is out in that in this cutscene. So I wonder who we're what we're dealing with here. Oh, it's Wario, okay. Of course, Wario jump scares you in, the, in Final Fantasy Wario's one, like, when you completely run out of power. Because Wario works the same as Freddy Fazbear, so that makes sense. His jingle's similar to Freddy Fazbear. Sonic has that jingle, too, when you run out of power in Final Fantasy Sonic's one. Oh, jump scare from Wario. Richard McCroy got the job as a night guard, however, during his last shift, he also vanished away. No words like the five workers. 
The government couldn't find any clue left from Richard, but they were, but they later found out that both engines were jammed. Because of this, they decided to reclose the factory again, but reopen the warehouse, which is more abandoned than the factory. The warehouse a bit close from the factory reopened and put it okay. The cutscenes are way too fast. I didn't get to read the whole thing. Okay, so apparently we had a cutscene where Richard McCoy runs out of power and dies. Okay. Interesting. But anyways, um, on to night four. Let's see what has to offer for us. And who are we going to be dealing with for night four? Oh, we got Peach and then Yoshi. Okay, so that's who we're dealing with. The princess and the dinosaur are now active. The princess will move towards your office, but it won't appear in the crossroad, which is the hallway. I figured out what crossroad is. It's another word for hallway in this game. Whenever it is in the one room, when it is in one room close, close to your door, close the door. Otherwise, it'll sneak into your office, resulting in your death. The dinosaur will be sleeping in the storage camera. Once it is gone, it'll rush into your office, shut the door before it enters. Okay. So for Peach, what we have to do is, if Peach is on the camera, which is closest to the office, we have to shut the door. Otherwise, it'll sneak in. She'll sneak into your office because Peach is very clever in this game. And then for Yoshi... If it wakes up, um, it will leave the he will leave the storage camera, and we have to shut the door before it enters in. So pretty much, Yoshi works the same as Foxy, and then Peach works the same as um, Ronald McDonald and as Ronald McDonald and Finance of Ronalds, where 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 you have to close the door. If he leaves a certain camera because he goes to the blind spot. Alright, so I'm going to be checking the office hall. So I'm going to have to check the office hall camera more frequently. Because that's the closest to the office. And that's where Peach is going to be coming from. And then for Yoshi, we have to check. This. Oh, we got a phone call. Okay. Okay, storage two. That's the camera we gotta be checking too. But the employees got rid of that thing in the room anyway. Oh, uh, and also, we found out some small information about the underground today. It turns out that the underground and the factory were connected with each other. I know it sounds weird because we found it out just now, but it just feels off. Anyway, that's. Okay, so for night four, we gotta constantly check the storage camera, which is the one where Yoshi is, and then the office hallway camera. And then, of course, we gotta check the server room camera. So those are the cameras, the three cameras we gotta focus on on the camera. We don't have to check any other cameras. Oh my god, why does Rosalina keep appearing? Like, I don't get it. Oh, Yoshi's starting to wake up, so... Alright, so I assume when Yoshi leaves the storage camera, we have to shut the door. Because he's starting to wake up, so... Up oh, Waluigi. Up oh, Yoshi's about to leave, okay... And there's Peach. Okay, so that's Peach's starting point. Okay. Gotta deal with Waluigi. Up, oh, Yoshi's about to leave. Ah, Mario! And Toad.
And Toad just drained half my power. God damn it, Toad. God damn it, Toad. You just drained half up. Oh, Yoshi's leaving. Gotta shut the door. And Peach just left, too. Okay, so... Peach and Yoshi left. Good. Uh, okay, Wario's here, but he's not at the door yet. He's just in the front hallway, so that's good. And I forgot to mention, Toad just had to drain half my power again at the worst moment. Like, no matter, sometimes, like, no matter how many times I click on the server room camera, like, Toad still finds a way to drain the power. Like, like, god damn it, Toad. Oh, Waluigi's here, and I gotta close the door for Wario. And I gotta check on Yoshi. Yoshi's still in the storage room, good. Wario and Waluigi both left, but Luigi's coming soon. And it's only 2 a.m., and I've wasted half my power. Thanks to not only Toad, but everyone moving constantly fast, because it's night four. Damn it, Mario. What are the odds of me being night four on the f night four on the first try? Not very good. I've got to deal with Luigi. I'm definitely going to be using more power for night four because I'm dealing with everyone all at once. Well, actually, not everyone all at once. Well, pretty much everyone all at once, but they're faster. Oh, and Yoshi's about to leave. Holy shit. Waluigi's about to come, so... Oh, Peach is here. Shut the door. And Yoshi's here, so I gotta shut the door for both of them. Check for Toad. Waluigi's gonna be coming soon. Is Toad here? Nope. Okay, I gotta open the door. I can open the door again. Waluigi, up oh, he's here. And now I gotta go check on Toad before he decides to bang the power, to drain the power down by banging. Which Toad always does at the worst possible moments. Wario's coming, okay. Peach and Toad. I mean, Peach and Yoshi are still in the storage room, so that's good. I gotta go check on Toad. Up, oh, Luigi's here, and Wario is still in the front of the hallway, so I gotta deal with him soon. Peach left the storage room. Yoshi's about to leave. Ah, Mario! Okay, Wario didn't move closer, thank God, because I had to deal with Mario. I was just about to deal with Wario, and I couldn't react in time. Thanks to me being distracted with all the other characters moving fast on night four. Rosalina. Why does Rosalina always have to show up at the beginning of the night? Like, is she just an Easter egg or something, or is it a Golden Friday? Like, I don't get it. Because Rosalina works the same as Mario. She got to the camera when she shows up. Yoshi's moving, checking the hallway and the server room camera. Here in the storage room, Waluigi and Luigi are in the hallway camera, so they're coming. A peach left, Yoshi's about to leave. 
Ah, Mario! Oh, great, I couldn't deal with Waluigi because I was too busy dealing with Luigi. Who do I gotta deal with first? Great. As expected, double teaming, double and triple teaming. Teaching you in the storeroom camera. Okay. Rosalina, and I got the old Waluigi. Oh my God. You serious, Toad? Always at the worst possible moments does Toad have to bang on the power and drain half of it. Oh shit, Peach is here and I gotta deal with Mario. And now Yoshi's here and then Wario's coming up next. Wario's up next. Wario, and then Peach and Yoshi, got an old Toad. Are you fucking serious, Toad? Why do you always have to drain the power when I'm about to deal with you? Waluigi. I gotta seriously, I gotta constantly check for Toad. That's the issue. Because Toad, you have very little time to react to. Mario's here, Luigi's coming. Up, oh, Luigi's here. And I'm probably gonna be most likely screwed no matter what because it's 2 a.m. and I wasted and I lost half my power thanks to Toad. I just double Peach. Yoshi's leaving, shut the door. Okay, got him this time. Perfect. I'm trying to click as fast as I can for Toad, but it's not that easy when I have to deal with, like, everyone at the same time. Mario. And then we got Wario and Luigi coming up next. Peach and Yoshi in the storage room. Okay, good.
Okay, Wario standing in the hallway. And then Luigi's coming. And then we got Peach and Yoshi. Luigi. Wario. Oh my god! Toad just drained the power again, and now I just lost power. God, I fucking hate Toad in this game. And here comes the jingle, and Wario's gonna kill me or somebody. Yeah, I knew I wasn't gonna make it past 5 a.m. with that roll of power. I think Yoshi's gonna come and kill me. What are the odds? Oh, Wario. Great. I really don't know what else to say at this point. I don't even have the words to say how utterly frustrating Night 4 is. Alright, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to end my video here and attempt to continue on Night 4 and Part 2 of the Let's Play because of how incredibly frustrating as fucking hell this is. But anyways, thank you for watching, everybody. Please hit the like button, also comment, and subscribe. I appreciate all the support you have all given me. Hit the bell to receive all notifications of upcoming videos on my channel. Be sure to follow me on TikTok and hit the bell on there to receive notifications of future videos as well. And until then, I will see you in the next video. Goodbye.